the method to my madness and what I do when I'm trying to get stuff done uh, and make something. And a lot of times there is no method. A lot of times something will come to me in a dream. Um, I'll be walking down the street and see a sign that reminds me of something else. And so my method to the madness in a lot of ways is anti-method. It's me just being out in the world, staying attuned and staying open to what I could possibly see that might um, inspire me or make me think about something different. So a few like weeks ago I had, no, a few nights ago, I had a dream and in that dream there's a drawing on the wall um, and as soon as I woke up I drew what I had seen on that wall um, and that's becoming a new piece of work. So yeah, a lot of stuff gets, gets done in my dreams. A lot of stuff gets done when I'm not thinking about the thing that I'm trying to make. And so I kind of just let my mind float and see what happens because sometimes when you're trying to think too hard on trying to make something good or trying to make something by a certain point or in a certain way, you get distracted by trying to make it perfect. Uh, so sometimes it's good just to be a little loose and just to let things happen and just, you know, uh, be excited about what could happen by accident, by chance, um, uh, by, by just, just, just being open and present and seeing what occurs.